Hello and welcome back hockey fans. On this episode, I got me a padded envelope from, I'm pretty sure that'd be the Upper Deck Company out of North Carolina. I guess we'll find out. So if you watched any of my previous videos, I got hosed on two hobby boxes of SP Authentic, getting nothing. No autographs, no numbered cards, just your regular top leaders or whatnot. So let's see what they have to say. Replacement and close. Case that. All right, thank you for your replacement request. The Upper Deck Company strives to produce the highest quality training cards on the market, and we apologize that the cards you recently did not meet these standards. Sure didn't. We are, however, more than happy to replace any damaged cards from our replacement stock and hope you enjoy the enclosed replacements. We offer, to, uh, we offer product replacements for our value customers for one year or while supplies last, whichever comes first. Factory stamp cards will be replaced with factory stacked cards. However, laser printed cards are replaced with hand numbered replacements. Thank you again for your continued support and we look forward to assisting you in the future. Sincerely, the Upper Deck Company Redemptions Department. All right, so I'm hoping they sent me at least, at least, I'm hoping four autograph cards, but from what I'm feeling, I guess we'll just pull them out one by one. I got maybe four in here. So let's see. Let's see, be card number one. We have a future watch. Carter Verhage, number 179 out of 999. Okay, out of the 1920 SP Authentic. All right. I think that might be a, might have been a redemption card. Card number two. Another future watch. Whoop. Connor McMichael, number 24. And that's 242 out of 999. Connor McMichael. That's a decent, decent pull there. I'll take it. I'll take it. All right. It's two. Hopefully, I got two more future watches in here. The survey says. Nope. Looks like I got a sign of the times of Darren Helm. Nice signature there. Sign of the times. All right, all right, so I'm assuming this next one's gonna be another sign of the time. Yep, four cards. Survey says, oh, it's my regular card, and it is Victor Olvison, limited auto. Okay. So, four autographs, I guess that's all. I guess it's decent, so all right, I guess that'll work for four autos for the i guess potentially four autos i'm missing so not too bad not too bad so let's go ahead and get right into the psa reveal not psa I keep saying PS, psa so i sent um 13 cards into beckett good old beckett grading services and here i go right here i already opened the box because the good old uh mailman decided to keep it in the rain so it got rained on a little bit so I have not seen these yet. So we'll be seeing both of these, all these together for the first time. I'm just trying to figure out how I want to pull these out of here. So I think this is the back. So let's go this way. Do it now, let's just pull them. <laughs> just pull them out one by one. And I'll cover the back. So I got there's 11, 11 hockey cards, and I submitted two football cards. These are some pretty decent cards here. Uh, some old future watch ones. Some regular rookie cards. So let's see what we have here first. Okay, here's my Mark Andre Fleury. Uh, SP Rookie Stars, numbered, what is this? Yeah, 212 out of 500. Figured it'd, it'd look pretty nice, so I figured I'd send this one in. And that's Mark Andre Flory, one of my favorites. Got to add the PC. So let's see what we got here. Oh, right off the, is that a gold? Yeah, it is a gold label. So that is a great sign. So 2003-2004 SPX. Mark Andre Flory got a 9.5 out of the center. 9.5 out of the edges. Corners 9.5, surface 10. So I'm guessing that's a 9.5 with an 8 on the auto. Ouch. 
out on the auto just because it's a little, I guess it's a little faded, but I still think it looks decent though. So, but 9.5 on the card, uh, I'll take it. Definitely for a jersey card, autograph jersey card. Awesome. I'll take that. I'll take a 9.5 with the 8. Oh, that hurt. Okay, let's see what's next. Let's, okay, here goes my future watch. Steven Stamkos. 561 on 999. Awesome signature there. I'm hoping that gets a 10. Even though it's a little faded down there. Come like, when he's coming loop around. Got this card out of a card show. Picked it up. Oh, it's definitely a 9.5 at least. Cool label. I dig it. All right, the 08, 09, that's pretty authentic. Centering, 9.5, edges, 9. Cornering, 10. Surface, 9.5, at least 9.5. And an autograph of 9. I freaking knew it. Uh, I'll take a 9.5, though. I'll take a 9.5 on a future watch. That's awesome. That's awesome. I'm hitting time one. <laughs> 9 on auto. That kind of hurt. But, oh, well. Oh well, oh well. Happy so far. I'm happy so far. Let's see, not looking. Next. All right. So here is the Kirill Kaprizov Allure. Okay. That's the extra rookie. 9595. 9595 Gem Mint. Awesome. I'll take that. I'll take that all day. 95 all around except for the corners. Pretty sweet looking card. Got this one on eBay. So, figured I'd give it a shot. Came out pretty good. I'll take it. All right, happy so far. All right, next card. All right, here goes my Austin Matthews. Picked this up at my local card store. Looks pretty cool, so I purchased it. So, let's see what we get here. Come on, give me a gold label. Darn, it's a silver label. 1617 OPG, Rainbow, Austin Matthews, 8.5 on the centering, ouch. 9.5 on the edges, 9 on the corners, 10 on the surface for a 9. All right, not bad. I thought I'd get at least a 8, 9.5 on this. So, yeah, I could see the center is a little off there on the right. It's a little thicker, but darn. Oh well, oh well, okay. Nice burn the eight though. All right, let's see what we have next. All right, here goes my young guns that I pulled. Right, let me push these cards back so I don't see them. I'll lean them up. Okay, here we go. My young guns. Kirill Kaprizov, young gun. All right. I thought this was a pretty good shape, so let's see. Got a gold label. That's awesome. 2021. Let's see. Centering is a nine. Edges, nine and a half. Corners, nine and a half. Surface, 10 for a 9.5. I'll take a 9.5 any day. Very nice. Very nice. I that the collection. Hopefully, he plays well this upcoming season. All right. So let's see what we have next. All right, here's my young gun, Austin Matthews. I got this off of eBay as well. Looked pretty decent on the photo, so I figured I'd purchase and send it in. Come on, let me see a gold label. Let me see a gold label. Damn it, silver. All right, okay, let's see what we got. This is, of course, 1617 young guns, centering, 9.5, edges, 8.5, ouch. Corners nine five surface ten for a nine. Man, edges nine eight and a half. I thought it was way better than that. I don't know. Looks pretty legit to me, but I don't know. I might have to resubmit it. Who knows? Who knows? But again, better than a eight. All right, let's see what we got next. All right, here goes uh, my Joe Burrow rated rookie pink optic. Let's see. He'll probably tear it up this year. Oh, another silver label. Nuts. All right, pink optic. Donruss. We got eight and a half on centering. 
nine and a half on the edges, quarters on and a half surface, seven and a half or eight and a half total. Ouch. Surface, really? I thought the surface was pretty clean when I sent this in. Hmm. Must have missed something. Oh well. All right. Next card we have is all right. Here's my Cooper Cup. The, the labels on the other side. Let's double whammy this. Oh no, I saw something bad on the next one. Wait, what is? Oh, uh, that's the invoice inside. Why would he do that? They put the invoice inside the card. All right, let me get this out of the way. Okay, so here's my Cooper Cup. Pretty awesome card, I thought. This is a rookie card for his 2017 certified collection. Nice auto, nice, brilliant patch. Love that patch, three color. All right, so we got, uh, we got gold, that's awesome. Let's see, we have centering, nine and a half, edges, nine and a half. Corners nine and a half, surface nine and a half. I bet that's a nine and a half. And the autograph ten. Awesome. Very awesome card. Very good looking card. I'll take that for a patch card and autograph all day. Nine and a half, ten. Sweet. All right, this next one I saw when I was moving that one around. This is my Austin Math. Austin Math, Jesus. Corin McDavid, rookie auto patch, and yeah, I saw the white immediately. Not not good. Fifteen sixteen SPX. Corin McDavid rookie centering seven. Oh, edges is nine and a half. Corners nine. Surface nine and a half or a seven and a half and a ten on auto, which is good. Seven on the centering. I don't know. I thought it was going to be a lot. I was hoping, ex expecting at least an eight with these jersey cards, but I don't know. I just don't see how it's off. Am I missing something? If anyone knows, please uh, comment down below. I don't know. I can't, I can't seem to picture it, but... Uh, seven and a half. Ouch. That stinks. All right. Moving on. Let's see what we have next. Okay. Here's my Andre Vasilevsky Future Watch Auto. Uh, 9.99 with the silver label. Boo. It's 14.15. SP Authentic. We have centering. Nine and a half. Edges nine. Corners nine. Surface eight. For eight and a half and a ten on the auto. Eight and a half, man. I guess it's better than eight, but I was hoping for a nine. Man, I thought this card was sweet. Surface, I don't see anything wrong with the surface. Uh, uh, all right, Nims of Breaks. I see that white corner down there, but other than that, eight on the surface? I don't know. I don't know. All right, next card. Okay, now here's my Victor Hedman. So of course I'm on a little bit of a Tampa Bay tear here. All right, another silver. Crap. 2009-2010 SP Authentic. Hedman with the centering. Uh, nine and a half edges, 8.5. Corners, 8.5. Surface, 10. So I got 10 on this surface. For eight and a half and a 10 on the auto. Craptastic. Man, I just don't understand the surface. I mean, it looked pretty much the same. But I guess they see something I don't. All right, let's see. I got two more cards left. Let's see, which one is this? All right, here's my Steven Stamkos Young Gun. All right, gold cool label. That's always a good sign. 0809, upright gun gun. We have a centering nine, edges nine and a half, corners nine and a half, surface 10 for a 9.5. All right, that's cool. I'll take that. 9.5 on the young guns. 
And for the last card, what do we got? In my Kioma car. Pulled this out of a pack. Fresh out of the box. Hopefully I get something good here. And I do not because it's a silver label. Kill my car. 1920. Young gun. 9.5, nine and a half on the centering edges. Corners 10. Surface 8.5 for a 9. Really? And I, what? Surface 8.5. Man, I guess they have do they have a surfacing machine there or something. I don't know. Man, that's a. Yeah, I see maybe it's a little bit of foil on the back. Maybe is that it? I don't know. But that's it. Well, thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate it. Let me know in the comments what you think. Or if you got hosed by Beckett or PSA or wherever or whoever. So, thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and we'll see you guys later. Peace.